offer just a little reflection, um, just a little encouragement for all of us to keep doing what we're already doing. And if you aren't, if you're not involved, which I doubt that anyone is not involved here, but if you're not involved, maybe some encouragement to get involved, to do something. So I like social media. Um, I don't have Facebook, but I do uh, Twitter and Instagram and some other things. And uh, it was pretty cool. I was just rated like one of the top ten clerics to follow in the country. <laughs> yeah. It's, it's because of the goofy posts and all of that, but, but that's kind of cool. It's a great way to evangelize and everything. I've gotten into trouble with it. I have a couple trolls out there, but, um, but that's all right. But I, I, I do that, and I follow the Pope. Pope Francis, he has millions of followers. Um, and every morning, I don't imagine that Pope Francis, any more than Benedict before him, sits down with a little phone to tweet. You know, but they do write these things. They write, or they come from a homily, or from a talk that they give, and their staff will just tweet out something every morning. And it's really interesting, if you follow the Pope, you'll know this, that his tweets are very, very basic, almost embarrassingly so. And every time I read a lot of them, I think, well, duh, I mean, everyone knows that. But, like, for instance, I thought I just looked at, at four over the past couple of weeks. The first one. Only those able to acknowledge their mistakes receive forgiveness. And God uses you and me to help our brothers and sisters. And we must do more than reject evil. We must build the common good. And then this morning, nobody can be discarded. Each of us is a treasure. As I said, they're very simple, pithy sayings, and I almost, I, like, sometimes I think, well, everyone knows that. Really? Do you have to, we have to tweet that out? The answer is yes, unfortunately, because either we forget it, or people these days don't think like that. But I think we need to remind people of these basic elements of our faith. 